If you contact a power line with your vehicle, call for help, stay where you are, and keep others at least 10 meters away from the vehicle. In the event of a contact, it is not just a vehicle, equipment, or object that could be energized. Everything within a 10 meter radius of the contact could also be energized. That's why you have to be aware of both step and touch potential. With step potential, electricity spreads, like ripples or rings, over the surface of the ground, away from the point of contact. Each ring carries a different voltage. If you step into one ring while your foot is in another, the electricity will make up the difference in voltage through your body. With touch potential, if someone on the ground touches what is in contact with the power line, electricity will travel through that person's body to get through the ground. If you hit a power line, you can try to break the vehicle free of the contact, but only if it doesn't cause more risk to yourself or others, or more serious damage to the power line. If you can safely break from the contact, move the vehicle or equipment at least 10 meters away to safety. If you must exit the vehicle, only in the case of a fire, jump away from the equipment with two feet together, then bunny hop or shuffle at least 10 meters away from the equipment. Don't take large steps, as there is the potential for electrical current traveling through your body. If you're not sure you're far enough away, slowly move your feet apart. If you feel a tingling sensation in your legs, you are still within the step potential zone and must continue to bunny hop or shuffle away.